Welcome back to Let's Play God of War. I'm Burning Dog Face. And, uh, Kratos and Atreus are, uh, hot on the trail of a ma magical deer. I guess it was magical. It had glowing antlers. But, uh, I got lured over here by the promise of wealth. I'd say it's time to Kool-Aid man this wall. Oh, yeah! I guess it would have to be me, not the axe, if it was really the Kool-Aid man. But, you know. Oh, that wasn't a... I thought there was a chest in here. Well, I guess I broke that for no reason, then. Yoink! Boy, over here. Whoa! Oh, look! It's Skull and Ati, the giant wolves who chased the sun and moon. Where did they come from? How did they get up there? What's happening there at the end? They eat the sun and moon? And then everybody fights? Ragnarok. Every shrine tells the story of a giant of legend. Find all Jotnar, sh or, uh, Jotnar shrines, rather. The giants left behind shrines to tell stories in their histories. Uh, the history. I loved these stories when Mom told them. Let's see how many we can find. Eleven, huh? I can do that. I hope. I wonder if Kratos knows that. You know, the Ragnarok thing, given that he's Greek. Skuld and Hati. Wolf giants. Skuld chases the sun and Hati the moon. What happens when they catch their prey? It looks like a massive fight. Odin, Thor, the world serpent, could it be? Oh, the world... Yeah, the Midgard serpent. Yeah, yeah, the one that wraps all the way around the world. I think it's supposed to... Uh... Uh, I think Thor and the Midgard Servants slay each other in uh, the final battle of Ragnarok. Uh, Thor kills the serpent, but only makes it a, a specific number of steps away from the body before he drops dead from the poison, because it bit him along the way. The thing I always found crazy about Ragnarok is that they know the, the Norse. Well, they knew exactly how it was going to happen. Exactly. Point for point. They knew that. They knew that the great god Thor, who has never been defeated, will definitely die when he faces the Midgard Serpent. Because everything in Norse mythology is prophecy. I knew that. It's a big cycle. When, after Ragnarok, when there is nothing left of the world but snow and ice, the world will start over in exactly the same way it did before. Everyone will live again and live out their lives precisely the same way. Even you, the, the mortals, like you and I, are bound by destiny. It's so metal. This tree is all fucked up on this side. I wonder if bears are scratching at it. Father, look. Wait for my mark. Relax. Indeed. Do not think of it as an animal. It is simply a target. Clear your mind. Steady your aim and breathe in. Feet solid. Steady yourself. Oh, uh, I'm not aiming at the face. Exhale. Whoa! Good. One shot! It's not yeah, but brought that big thing down. It's oh. still alive. Oh. Your knife. Ah. No. Finish what you started. I'm sorry. <sighs> to both of you. I can't.
Scott and page him. Do it, man. Be a father. Atreus, Ar Atreus arrows. He said it us, not use. Uh, press X to command Atre uh, Atreus to shoot arrows. Hold left trigger, then press X to target a specific enemy. Uh, enemies will be distracted from attracting, attacking Kratos when they are hit by an arrow. Number of arrows uh, At Atreus can shoot is indicated in the lower right corner. Once shot, arrows take time to recharge. Okay. Tap. Oh, let's not use that just yet. No! No oh, shit! Yeah, I noticed that. I'm not doing very well so far. Kind of wondering that myself. No. Right. No. Ow, my organs. I need to hit these glowy bits, I think. Oh, no. Oh, I hate this. It doesn't actually seem to have any... Oh, boy. Ah. Healing, healing, come on, you'd think the green light would stand on oh, there. I guess assumed there'd be more than one if he said that. Okay. He didn't even fucking flinch! Oh, I got him down to one bar, I think. Yes. No! I thought you got flattened there for a second. Wait. Oop. Did it right the jump? You big ugly fuck. Okay, 
in the butt. Nicely done. Oh. gonna feel that one. Hey, big guy, what's it like to be circumcised? <laughs> it's a new experience for you, isn't it? Right? Like, he's, uh, not even- he's doing, like, no-cell attacks. Yes, yes, of course, I forgot. So that distracts him. I don't think that does any damage. Ow. Oh, that was bad. Oh! Oh! Oh, right. Dotty Kaup Matter. Fuck you. Oh! Damn it! You need to get better at the timing of this stuff. Hey, uh. Hey, you know what? Oh! interrupt an attack, but... Oh. oh, you didn't like that, did you? Ah. I gotta hit him in the face of this thing. That's the weakness. Go! Buddy, if you knew what this man has faced, he's just out of practice. You're very lucky right now. He's even looking and acting beat up. I love that. Die, you freak! Yeah, this is a God of War game. That's where you get Boy. Think I'm afraid of you! You're nothing to me! Boy, nothing! look at me! Look at me, boy! Wow. Boy, look at me. We did it. Ready. Oh no. What? Are you serious? I found the deer. I proved myself. How am I not ready? We are going home. I haven't been sick in a long time. I can do this. You are not ready. I think he reminded Kratos of himself right there. Oh. I am ready. 
Do not speak again. That was really badly hurt. Trolls Toll. Kill trolls. Encounter more of these colossal horned totem bearers by thoroughly exploring the lands you can do, uh, traverse. Consult the bestiary for tips on defeating them. Oh boy. Dowdy Kaup Matter. I think the troll we just fought was Dowdy Kaup Matter. Uh, mother used to always tell me stories about him to try and scare me if I wandered off too far. I think she'd be proud of me, but father thinks because I got a little angry that I'm not ready. Whatever, I just helped him kill a troll. I know I'm ready. I mean, the kid's well educated enough to use a fucking semicolon. Mother told me a lot of stories about trolls. This one's name translates to Death Merchant. With a name like that, I think it's safe to assume he was pretty evil. I'm glad we killed him. Well, I can't really argue with that logic. <laughs> Death Merchant. Ah, here we go. Armor. Tunic of Hope. Fashioned from leather and wolf hide. A gift from Atreus's mother. I like that. It refer on, on the item for Kratos, it refers to her. Whoever she is. I don't think she got a name. As uh, a memento from Kratos' deceased wife, but over here it's a gift from Atreus' mother. It's, it's about the relation. What's this? Oh. Uh, strength increases damage for all standard attacks. Runic increases both runic attack and elemental damage. Defense reduces all damage taken. Vitality increases maximum health and decreases the severity of hit reactions from enemy attacks. That seems interesting. Maybe you won't stagger. Luck increases perk activation chance. Increases XP and hack silver gains. Cooldown reduces re recharge time of runic attacks, runic summons, and talismans. I wouldn't just have this. Oh, you wouldn't just have this open all the time because it hides Atreus. That's why. Let's take a look at his armor. Death's vow tunic. Black funerary honor or armor for Atreus to or Atreus to honor his fallen mother. Enemies choked by Atreus will take increased damage. Okay, I guess if it doesn't have any benefits. Um, but we'll go back home first. Don't get changed out. The path home is this way. Duh. Ah, yes. Sorry, the bald head and no shirt made me think that was, like, Kratos' old model for a heartbeat there. That would be weird. That was nice teamwork, considering he didn't even tell him what he wanted to do. Where'd the deer go? I'll leave that one. I don't need that right now, and this game does seem to be somewhat open. Stunning enemies. An enemy's stun bar is located below their health bar. This is new. Attacking an enemy in quick succession inc inflicts stun damage, causing the bar to fill. Once the bar is filled, the enemy is stunned. Press right stick to grab a stunned enemy. That's not going to be good for him. Uh, the audio just cut out. That's strange. Attacks and barehanded attacks inflict extra... Uh, arrows, sorry, and barehanded attacks. Kratos can switch to barehanded attacks by throwing the axe or sheathing the axe by pressing right on the D-pad. <laughs> Fuck you, man. Yeah, that's more like it. I was thinking that, uh... I was surprised that the troll's head didn't come off. Also, a nice amount of gold. Or hack silver, even. Stun grab enemies. Enemies stun grabbed. One to twenty-five, and enemies are stunned and flash red. Press button to grab them and deal massive damage. You be dead. Let's not punch that guy. He's on fire. Oh, I found a back step. I actually. Yoink! 
297 little ones. I mean, they're not really big ones, are they? Ooh, does this mean what I think it means? Well, that's inconclusive. I don't know why I was expecting uh, all three of them to have something in them. Most games don't do that. That's a very well-rendered, splintered tree right there. Hidden chambers. Find and enter all of the chambers when able. One of seven. There are seven locked doors throughout the world. Find them all. I'm pretty sure I either press B here or I make this thing freeze because of, from the look of it. I, I was right. It did drop that. But uh, we're going to have to check that in the next episode of Let's Play God of War. Because... Uh, well, the timer just went, that's why. Oh, I am leaving footprints. Nice. What if I roll? <laughs> well, I guess I don't leave marks there, but I did leave mud on Kratos' back that quickly evaporated. <laughs> nice. Uh... In that case, I guess I will just call it. Yeah, I had a tiny sliver there. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I will see you on the next episode when we uh, press on with our journey home, and uh, Kratos probably continues to be nowhere near the list of uh, potential candidates for Father of the Year. <laughs> Oops. Well, that's as good a time as any to do that since the controller just deactivated. Later! <laughs>